Yes, yes, yes. Son. Hello, this hello. Yes, little man, yes. This is my son. What is his name? Alaji Forde. Alaji? Forde. Alaji Forde. That is the sub that now now Uz, uh, Uzman, tell us the name of the school that we had. We are at Matex uh, Primary School and Dino School. It is located at Abuko area. So the headmaster of the school is called uh, Alex. And this is Alex right here? So what I would recommend is just you, you coordinate it as far as what goes here and what stays back for uh, the other school. That way, I could, you know, you can, if you kind of work it. So family, we're here at one of our schools here in the Gambia. So we have one school today and one tomorrow. And we're going to split these school supplies and show some love. Uh, this is actually a time when school is not really open. You know, that's why me and Mr. Bomai Dakari is out here. We're on spring break. So we were able to you know, get some of the students to get organized so we can at least come and show them some love, make some donations, and also share some school supplies. Uh, so, uh, so Usman, Usman uh, what, uh, what, what you and Abdul can do is uh, you just split the supplies and see what goes here and what uh, goes to the next school. And it's all good. All right, so family, this is the mission statement. Anyway, this is my son. And that is my wife. She came to, she came to collect my son. I said, no, wait for me. Until I... She was a teacher in one of the other schools. Miss Lee. Uh, yeah. uh, let, let's, uh, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, unless you want to squeeze in there also on the next one. I do. Nice, nice. Yes. So, you so you are, uh, wow, you're Usman's wife. N yeah. Nice to meet you now. He's been working with me. Is, okay, is he our short? African for Yes, uh, we're going to put him in. All right. Uh, hold on. Let's. Cheese, cheese, cheese. Okay. Right, uh, here you go. I got another one for you. No cheese. He said no cheese. Here you go. Yes, family. So nice little school in the neighborhood. So it's one of those things where we gather school supplies and we just show love. Our group members are always excited to bring and share supplies. Nice smiles. All right, is the rest of the supplies off, the boss? Yes. Did you separate them? Yes. Oh, thank you, brother. Appreciate it. <laughs> there you go. Appreciate it. So we got that worked out. We're just going to take a stroll to the school. And family, you know, if you want to do anything and connect with any of these schools, you can always reach out to me. You know, wherever we travel to different countries, that's always the goal. The goal is always to you know, connect with our children, connect with our people, uh, have an everlasting impact. And sometimes it just starts from just a small energy. And this is more of what, what uh, school age? Level two. Level two is uh, what age? Like age? Uh, okay, age is uh, nine. Okay, nine. Level two. Yeah, level two. Yeah. Yeah. So the children are between what? Six to uh, six to. Oh, six. So in America, it would be like first, second, and third grade. That's what we would call it. This is your 
Yeah, they're playing pool, I love it. Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's similar to pool, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Bomani. Son, Bomani. Son, Bomani. How are you? What do you think about this school? So you can see the schools don't it's not fancy like the schools you have and that's why we try to support love. No, it's not fancy like the schools you are, but that's why we show love and everything. Well, compared to the ones that we go to, it is. And I'm always telling our children to be thankful for what they have. Because some children don't have certain basic things in their school. So you know, a lot of times our children in America, they don't really understand that you know, what they have is a, a decent situation to work with. Uh, so family, we're here to just always show love and energy. But you know, this is what we have to work with. You, know? you, you can see some of the situations with the tables and the chair. So whenever we talk about donations and financial contributions to schools, you know, we're just trying to just reach out to anyone that's open to showing love. That's primary first over here. Yes, my sister. Appreciate the love. Appreciate the love. Yes. Yes. Yeah. That's what I love, family. We have wonderful groups of people come and you know, we just show love unconditionally and, you know, we're a part of building our global community and build up energy of our children so we can all you know, be a part of a strong future where we can compete. Uh, so a strong education system is a foundation to compete in. And let me see what's back here. So it also look like uh, a daycare also. So Abdul, what I need is a bucket or something or a little uh, pan or something so we can put some financial donations in there for the school. Okay. Can, Alex, oh, you're going to work that out? I know. Perfect. Alex. No, I just need to no, no, ask about the school. Oh, yes. Uh, you see that uh, cup right there? Just trying to get something to where we can put some financial donations and contribute to the school. <laughs> uh, she, you, I mean, she has something good. That's a school that's initiated in children, established individually with a whole lot of uh, uh, difficulties. And then uh, we've been trying to meet it up, make it up because uh, we believe at least, yeah, education can go to, can be, can be, uh, it can have education at any way. But at least, environment matters in understanding. So all the while, we've been trying to see how we can be able to meet up. So we've been trying to pick from here and there, collecting, being an individual uh, effort. Let me just put in that way. This is purely individual, and it is me. You know, since like seven years, nobody has been caught. I've tried sometimes, I'll be wrong to make sure things work. Even with the teachers, they will be sometimes. They will like take it from me. Sometimes I go and work to make sure because I love this project, not because of the benefit, it's because of I feel this should be. I see them. Sometimes I want to quit. But my students say, go ahead. Go ahead. I said, I am tired. They say, go ahead. What am I doing? 
so I have seen difficulties. Even the people who came, he brought to help me, can even cause a problem. Mm. What am I doing? Sometimes I say, let me just be under my bed and be alone. I don't want to talk to anybody again. But the spirit, the the, the, the vision, the the mission will say, go, go, go. Yes, brother, absolutely. Just yeah. go. I but they're hanging to the fight. Go here, they're waiting for you. I'm telling you the truth. It's a real fact. I would like to quit. I would say, I cannot do this. I am tired. I cannot just do it alone. He said, go there. Go and stay. Sometime I will leave the rectorship. I will leave the head teacher. I will go to class in order to assist, to teach. The joy is that those things are moving. But at the end of the day, the stomach has to do something. At the end of the day, this is... You have to maintain the place, you have to pay people, I'm happy we have about 23 people here. Also, with my little, our little effort, we are able to put little computer because we always want them to have at least a little idea of what is going on in the world. Yes, Whether absolutely. Whether it is complete or not. Whether it is a best or not. But you must know this happens somewhere. That's what we have done. You see our little snooker, our little table tennis and all that. Just to tell them these things are happening. But it may not be the best here, but it is happening somewhere. So have an idea of what is going on in the world. Yes. But maybe tomorrow, I don't know what can happen, you can say I have seen it before. That's always what I have created. That is maintain it. And then to make sure that at least they have basic knowledge with what happens in our world. Yeah. This is, what happened to this in your time? Let's get, let's get that bucket so we can put some yeah, donations yeah, in yeah, here. Yeah, there we go. Just what happened now, the director, as he was speaking, we have, just, we have, we have a group. We have we all come and join together. So what happened was, People, some of the Gambian people, when they have the, they're looking for money. So they used to demand for a lot of money payment. And he told them that, look, this is, we are helping the public. Let's manage. So people said, okay, I'll queue. So some of the teachers will say, oh, if you don't pay us big money, we're going. And this is the only school when a small boy will learn here, they learn French. My son can speak French. He's five years old. He can start French from one to hundred. He can speak English. And here they learn also Spanish. We also do Dutch. They do Dutch also. So this is the other school. You're getting them ready for so the international like world. Not everybody bring their skills here. So that's why we also, you know me, I'm always looking for the group for the people. So that's why we also we help him by paying school fees and then paying student uh, buying uniforms. And then he brought the uniforms, he give you, you pay him. So that because sometimes not everybody can afford the uniform at the right time. So but he will give it to you, then your fees come, and then you pay. We start now. Even the school fees, you most pay times, everything. If I bring our, most times, more than we are even pay. We are able to pay salary. Yes. If I bring our list, we are all with these parents. What am I going to do? Am I going to kill them? No. My Why? joy is that even I'm even calling them, bring the child. Just bring the child. Bring, please. You used to allow kids to come to school bring. without paying. Do you pay small, small, please tell me. If this is one week, they give us nothing at least to keep with Walking. Just bring I call them because in fact today I want to see some of them at home. That's why you're not coming. That's good. That's perfect, that's perfect. So, thank you very much. So, we pre appreciate... Uh, you yeah. You can go upstairs. Oh, yeah, perfect. I'm going to just go through here real quick. Coming down also. Alright, so family, a little something. Uh, and you can always send a little something in so we can send here. 
show some love. They're showing you the last set of classrooms. Hey. Yeah, that's, that's what's up, brother. This is what's up. And it's something to work with, and we just got to keep building the energy. All right, brother. How long did they go to school? How long did they stay? No, for this school, we, when the kids come in the morning, they stay up to five years. They have food here. They don't have sunglasses. They feed them every day. 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 That's a family. We're here in the Gambia showing love. So our good brother Uzman, his son go to the school, want to come here, drop off some school supplies, meet some of the teachers, give you a tour of you know, one of our schools, and you know, just keep a strong connection as we just show our children that we want to be a part of the future so we can get our generation ready to compete on a world and a global scale. The family, once again, it's Bomani Tamba here live in the Gambia, and the journey continues. The journey continues. Yes, brother. The journey continues.